had three hits and a couple of runs early. And did it, did it seem like after that that Gonsolin settled in and, and then the bullpen things kind of dried up? Yeah, he sure did. We weren't able to get anything going, um, the two homers, but weren't able to get a lot of guys on base to get anything going. Um, and that was that was really the story offensively. Um, Joey swung the bat really well all night um, in the two homers, but uh, yeah, give him a lot of credit there. After the home runs, he settled in and, and pitched a good game. Good to see India get that home run swing back as he kind of eases his way back. Yeah, definitely. He's. Um, it's not easy just jumping into the middle of the season. I mean, he he definitely did everything he could to prepare himself. Um, but it's, it's a it's a tough game, even for a, a really good player like John. And um, yeah, it's going to take take some time. But every every day he gets closer and closer to where he wants to be. How did you feel about, about Malley, given the uncharacteristic number of hits he gave up, but the fact that he gave you six innings and, and four runs? Yeah, I mean, we're used to. Uh, to seeing Tyler do really special things on the mound, have you know great nights. In, in, in some ways, starts like what he did tonight were, are even more impressive to me. Um, you know, against that lineup, keeping us in the game. Like you said, it allowed some hits. Um, you know, a couple well placed, taking nothing away from the Dodgers, but a couple well placed ground balls. A few of them really uh, of Tyler and and Raver and. You know, it could have been different. Taking nothing away from you know Freeman, who comes up with a couple of big hits, um, but overall, I think Tyler just gave everything he had, um, all the way to the last hitter, um, to you know give us a shot right there.